This is Winston. He's a two-year-old English Mastiff, and he's here today for his full professional grooming. Winston weighs a whopping 200 pounds, and grooming him is an extreme sport. Keep watching until the end of this video if you'd like to see me struggle trying to move this massive boulder. Okay, Winston. Let's do this thing. Are you shedding just as bad this time as last time? Oh, pretty much, eh? Holy bo. Good boy. Don't lay down yet. Don't do it. So Winston here became a beloved character on my YouTube channel because he is obviously handsome, he's massive, and he is so gentle. If you guys want to see more of him, I encourage you to follow along on his social media channels which are linked below for you because to see this giant dog with his little baby humans is honestly so adorable. You will love it just as much as I do. Would you mind standing for like just a second so I can scrub your butt? Stand? Do you know the word stand? Ah, come on, get to it. I definitely can't lift you, that's for sure. <gasps> up, up. Good boy. Good boy. Okay, stay there for like, shoot. One second. Don't move, don't move. And that's conditioner, not shampoo. Great. Good boy. Don't sit yet. Thank you for your cooperation. No, don't shake. Don't do it. Okay, I need more shampoo. I guess he has a pretty thick coat. Oh! That's great. Okay, sir, let's do this again because you're one hairy beast. So when you're grooming a dog like this, a really important part to clean is under here because they drool and the drool sits on their coat and then it starts to stink pretty bad. So this needs like a really good scrubbing. Otherwise, the smell is just not fun. I'm gonna use the Zoom Groom to scrub in all this shampoo and it will also help to loosen up all of his shedding coat. Right, buddy? How am I gonna rinse you if you refuse to stand? He says, it's not my problem. This way, this way, sir. Turn. Thank you. Come here, buddy. shampoo this dog's big giant noggin. You're like a horse. You're like a big giant horse. Oh, please don't shake with that slobber. You're gonna get it all over me. I 
have to rinse your butt. So you have to stand. Please. Okay, up, 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 up. Good boy. Stay standing for like a minute. Well, I am officially soaked. Thank you, sir. So for those of you that remember from my main channel, he is 200 pounds. So he is about 100 pounds heavier than I am. So forcing this dog to do anything he doesn't want to do is a death sentence. Oh, you like the towel? You just like attention. I think you're an attention hog. You're a good boy. Such a nice dog. Okay, spray him down with the stuff for dogs. This is a different bottle, but it's actually the stuff inside this bottle. I just really like this spray bottle. So that's why I use it. The happy hoodie does not fit him because his head is massive. Even the extra large doesn't fit him. So he does not wear one and we are gonna dry him with the K9 high velocity dryer. We groomers like to drink coffee with our hair. Let's get all this slobber off you. Okay, so I'm gonna keep him in the belly band while I de-shed him just because I won't be able to brush his back end properly. And yes, he is losing a ton of hair. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do his back end first and then he can lay down and then I can do the rest of his body. You are a shedding beast, man. He is overstanding at this point. Okay, I think I'm going to change this up a little bit because he's uncomfortable. I think what I'm going to do is let him go on the floor. Okay, I'm gonna let you down, buddy. I'm gonna let him go on the floor and I'm gonna do him on the ground. I think that he would be happier with that. Sit down, lay down. Okay, stay there. Okay, I think this will be better for him. He's much more comfortable this way. I'm not, but who cares about me, right? He says, yeah, pretty much, it's all about me. Are you happier now? Are you a happier dog? You're too big to be standing for that long. Okay, Let's see if I can turn you. Mm. <laughs> 
Oh my God. Okay, buddy, go. <laughs> You're funny. Can you help me at all? Even a little bit? <laughs> good boy. Yes, good boy. Good boy. There we go. Good boy. That's what I wanted. Come on, lay down. Lay down. Lay down. That was very helpful, though. Okay, I have to clip your nails now. Good boy. These ones are really short, really, really short, just a tip. Okay, and then what about these front ones? These ones look like they're pretty long. You're a good boy, Winston. You're a good boy. Very good boy. Good boy. Winston, are you an angel? He's looking at me like, F off, lady. F off, lady. What a good boy, Winston. What a good boy. You're a good man. Yes, you're gonna get a treat after this. But I have to finish your nails first. Are you trying to eat it? <laughs> Can I see? You want a treat? I'm gonna give you a treat for that. Good boy. Come here, sit. Okay, down. Good boy. <laughs> he wants more treats. Okay. But first, flip this giant ear over. A bit itchy. A little bit itchy. No, I don't use gloves. Why? Because I don't care. That's why. Ooh, okay, this one looks infected, I'll have to tell the owner. This one's very red, and I think we're gonna need, yeah, definitely infected. Oh, he's, oh, I'm sorry. I can't tell if that felt good or not. I think it feels good, I think it's itchy. I think he likes it. I'm gonna have to use another one. Good boy. These types of dogs are, ugh, look at that, are prone to ear infections because of their big floppy ears. No, you cannot eat it, although I know you want to. And diet can play a huge role as well in ear infections, so I'll just have to let them know. So this big giant beast is all finished. Can we get up to say goodbye to everybody maybe, do you think? What do you think? Are you a good man? Are you a good boy? Oh, he doesn't want to be here anymore. I'm gonna spray him down in some blueberry cologne and then he's all finished. I'm ready to go home and take a nap, right? Thank you guys for watching and I will see you again next week. Say bye, Winston. Bye.